evaluator, <coughs> fellow Toastmasters, and especially Tim. The goal of Tim's speech was to organize his speech, which I think he did extremely well. You know, I can relate to sailing. Remember, I uh, tried to impress my future wife by taking her sailing in a lake in Lincoln, Nebraska, and uh, <laughs> uh, we capsized. <laughs> that was the impression. But she still married me anyway. <laughs> I liked your opening when you talk about what do you want to do when you're stressed and you're frustrated and you're tired, and, and that led into your passion for Satan. Because it really is a passion for you. And I can tell that it's a passion. And you do some excellent things in this speech, which for a second speech was well done. Advanced kind of speech, organizing and structuring, where you forecasted for us the four things. The obvious, that it's outside. The challenging, both mentally and physically. The relaxing nature of sailing and the magical nature of sailing. And then you proceeded to elaborate on those four things. So that was great forecasting and leading the audience in the direction that you wanted them to go. You had a little bit of humor in there. You like the sailing, but not the people. Which is by what which is why, by the way, I like scuba diving, because then I don't have to talk to anyone. <laughs> <laughs> what I would have liked to see a little bit more out of this is to connect with the audience a little more and bridge in the gap, because I don't know how many people here have been sailing, but there are other opportunities to connect with the audience as far as the ocean, the wind, the spray of the waves coming into your face. And then the other thing I would have liked to have seen a little bit more of is bring out your passion more. Your tone tended to be on an even keel. Talk about sailing as the wind catches the sail and you're racing down parallel to the beach and you see the sand and the trees and the you get the idea. So bring out your passion a little bit more. And I mean I can tell the way you were speaking, but I think you could have connected with us a little bit more. And it would have drawn a more vivid picture for us of what sailing really is. The challenge at the end could have been a little bit stronger. And I'll conclude by saying, don't tell people if you have the opportunity, but say, next time you're at the beach and you see that sailboat there, make the leap. Go sailing. Mm -hmm.